You can know where you are and have an idea of where you're going, or you can know where you are and have some understanding of how you arrived there. Your attention will be directed in one way or the other, either toward the future, envisioning where you're going, or toward the past, remembering how you arrived where you are. Once again, well, I won't repeat it actually, I was going to. The focus I wanna put on right now, the point, the main point is, you are where you are. That's where you are right now in this present time moment. And while occupying a space, a point in time, that's referred to as present time, while occupying that space of present time, your attention will be directed toward the future or your attention will be directed toward the past. Simple as that. Now, if you want to build a brighter future, I encourage you to focus your attention toward the future. If you want to gain greater understanding of life and living and people and yourself in general, then look to the past and analyze it. So what's more important to you currently? Understanding why you are the way you are, why you do the things you do, why others are the way they are, why others do the things they do. If that's more important to you, understanding of the why, then look to the past and analyze it. But if that's not the most important thing to you right now, then I suggest and I recommend you look toward the future. Decide what it is that you would like to have in the future and then focus on figuring out ways to arrive at that point to cause those things to occur. You may already know what it is you want in the future. Let's assume for a moment you do want something specific that you know that you want. Let's say you decide you want $10,000 monthly income. That's the target, that's the goal, that's the objective. You want $10,000 a month income. You look at where you currently are. How much income do you have? Well, it's an amount that's not yet $10,000 a month. So the question is, what can you go from where you are? What can you do that will take you from where you are to the point of having the $10,000 per month of income? Put your attention on answering that question. Find multitudes of answers or one answer. But what can you do to go from where you are financially to arriving at a point where you have $10,000 a month income? If that's your goal. If it's not your goal, whatever your goal is, plug that in and ask yourself or have someone else ask you, what can you do that will move you in that direction and help you to eventually arrive there?